Hey everyone, happy Monday for May 17th here with your day trading recap. Uh, small green today, green day today, plus 221. Uh, was up quite a bit more, gave some back here later in the morning. So let's go through these, I'll show you what we did. Starting with our one mighty 90 trade in Zoom, booked 475, no pairs trades today. Uh, on the runners, had a, a winner in Apple for 346, a winner in Boeing for 155, Roblox, plus 467, and then uh, negative trades in Roku, AMD, and Zoom. So let's take a look at these, and I'll show you what we did. Starting with uh, our first trade, which is a mighty 90 uh, in Zoom. So let's take a look at Zoom. So Zoom had this nice push up to start, a little spike in volume, got short up here, and caught this uh, nice little down move here. I would have gotten out with even more profit, but I was I was paying attention to other trades and trying to get filled, and then this thing bounced quick on me, and so uh, ended up getting out of my last piece uh, after this little bounce. So still booked 475, nice winner in Zoom. And then on the runners, so let's look at Apple to start. So an Apple uh, had this initial flush lower and then it, boun it bounced up and it kept trying to get through this pivot, trying to get through, trying to get through. So I got short right here, uh, looking for a continuation lower and got that. So it caught a nice, uh, nice move lower, got out of most of it. Uh, and then when it started to push up again, about right in this area here, I cut out of my last piece. Uh, so I booked a winner of 346 in Apple in Boeing. Uh, Boeing uh, had a nice little volume spike here. So on this bounce, got short, caught a nice flush, got out of three quarters of my position down here. And then this thing just ripped higher. I held, thought it was gonna come back down and then it bounced again. And when it bounced up here, I ended up cutting out of my last piece and, uh, and just booked a small winner of plus 155. Roblox, uh, quickly becoming a nice little trading vehicle. It's a newer stock. Uh, but this one uh, did an upside runner uh, with this, big volume spike here really on this it, this is a little pullback but got long right here caught a nice push up uh got out of uh, a bunch of it came back down got in some more pushed up got out of some came back down got in again pushed up and i was just staying super small here but through all that uh and then when it started to kind of um oh, right here it was it was the market was really rallying and, and this thing was just kind of sitting there so i ended up cutting out of the last piece here did get another rally i was trying to wait for this pivot uh, but didn't quite get there in the time frame I wanted to, so I just cut out, but still booked a $467 profit in Roblox. AMD, oh, let's see, Roku, let's go to Roku. Uh, so Roku, I did have a decent profit in here, and then she took it all away. So I had a big, uh, big volume spike here on this pullback, got long, caught a nice push up, got out of um, half of the position here, and then when it came back down, I added back in, looking for another bounce, uh, and that didn't happen. This thing just kind of flushed. So I ended up, when it bounced back up, ended up just closing out of that uh, and taking a loss on Roku. And then a couple late day trades in AMD. So I was looking for, uh, the, the market looked like it might potentially get strong. So I was looking for some long positions. Um, AMD initially had pushed up, then it came all the way back down to negative territory and then pushed up, made a nice push above yesterday's high, above this pivot. So when it started, uh, started to pull back here, I got long looking for a continuation higher, uh, but the market just really started getting weak. So when it flushed down, I just cut out of it. Uh, took a loss of 315. And then Zoom, I sat in this one for a while looking for some upside, kind of the same, got in about the same time as AMD, uh, same kind of scenario. It uh, showed initial strength, came down, got negative, and then pushed right back up. And so when it was chopping around above yesterday, above Friday's high, got long here, looking for a continuation. This thing just chopped and chopped and chopped and chopped. So when it started to break down here, I just cut out and took a loss. So still small green day today, plus 221. Uh, could have been a lot better, but you know that's the way trading goes sometimes. So if you guys have any questions, let me know. Otherwise, we'll be streaming live every day this week. Uh, we'll be offline all of next week. So look forward to seeing you in the live stream uh, the next few days. Talk to you then.